गुड मॉर्निंग फ्रेंड्स माय नेम इज डॉक्टर नीतू रावत आई एम एन असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर इन मियाने गर्ल्स कॉलेज ऑन द बिहाफ ऑफ गुरु के पी ओ टूडे आई विल एक्सप्लेन यू अबाउट द स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ अ बैक्टीरियल सेल द स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ बैक्टीरियल सेल देर आर द फाइव मेजर पॉइंट्स ऑफ द स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ बैक्टीरियल सेल फर्स्ट इज द डिस्कवरी एंटीवन ल्यूवेन हॉक the bacterias were first of all discovered by leuven hock and leuven hock is also called as the father of bacteriology second category is the habitat bacterias are found everywhere on the earth they are found on land in water air soil but still they are not present in rainy water third category is the size bacterias are very small in size which cannot be seen without a microscope the smallest bacteria are new bacterium and the biggest bacteria is bagia tua fourth category is the shape there are various kinds of shapes of bacteria first and their major types are first is the coca cocus shape bacteria second is the rod shape bacteria and third category is the spiral or helical shape bacteria coca shape bacteria are round shape bacteria and they are non motile and their main categories are first is the micrococci they are small and rounded structures and the number of these kind of bacteria is single diplococci second category is the diplococci when the bacteria are present in the form of pair then they are called as diplococci third is the tetracococci when bacteria are present in number of fourth and final is the staphylococci when bacteria are present in groups second rod shape bacteria these type of bacteria are elongated cylindrical and the, their main categories are diplobacillus and streptobacillus diplobacillus when bacteria are present in pairs and streptobacillus when bacteria are present in long chain third category is the spiral or helical shape bacteria these are the comma shape bacteria an example of this bacteria is vibrio cholerae now fifth is the structure of a bacterial cell the main structural features of a bacterial cells are capsule surface appendages cell wall cell membrane or plasma membrane and cytoplasm and cell organelles so first layer is the capsule or slime layer this layer is present just outside the cell wall and if according to some scientist if this layer is made up of nitrogenous substances then it is called as capsule and if this layer is made up of polysaccharides then it is called as slime layer it is a water rich mucilage covering present just outside the cell wall the function of capsule layer is that during unfavorable conditions this layer provide nutrition to a bacterial cell due to the presence of water this layer protect the bacterial cell from drying second is the surface appendages there are two main categories of surface appendages first is the flagella these are the flagellas flagella are made up of flagellin protein and the presence of flagella uh, the fla the basic components of flagella are basal granule hook and filament and the main function of flagella is that they help in movement of bacteria as Bac flagella are present in bacteria then they these bacteria are called as trichus if flagella are absent in bacteria then they are called as a trichus type of bacteria third is the cell wall cell wall is made up of murine and peptidoglycan and the three basic main components of cell wall are n acetyl muramic acid n acetyl glucosamine and 4d amino acids fourth category is the cell membrane or plasma membrane cell membrane or plasma membrane is present just inside the cell wall and the major components of plasma membrane are proteins and lipids the protein molecules are embedded in phospholipid layers so the uh, structure of cell membrane or plasma membrane looks like a fluid mosaic model and the last and final point is the cytoplasm and cell organelles the uh, 80% of cytoplasm is present in the form of water nucleic acids carbohydrates protein lipids are present in cytoplasm and cell organelles are absent in bacteria because they are prokaryotic microorganisms but two type of cell organelles are present first is the mesosome and second is the ribosomes these are the mesosomes 
in a bacterial cell structure these are the mesosomes 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 help in respiration and second is the ribosomes ribosomes 70s type of ribosomes are present in bacteria and the two main subunits of ribosomes are 30s and 50s subunit the main function of ribosomes are protein synthesis so this is all about the structure of a bacterial cell thanks for watching this video please like comment share and subscribe our youtube channel and visit our website gurukpo.com thank you so much